Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for July the 12th of 2021. Well, it is titled M27, the Dumbbell Nebula. So what do we see here? Well, this is what is known as M27. And that was part of a catalog done by Charles Messier back in the 1700s. And it, this was object number 27 in his list of objects that were slightly extended and did not look like stars in the sky through the small telescopes he was using. And in fact, they could often be confused with comets. So it was a catalog of these objects that unlike comets would not change their position and remain the same to avoid further confusion. Now what it turns out is that there's a whole bunch of different kind of objects in his catalog. There are nebulae such as this one, there are star clusters, and there are even galaxies such as the Andromeda galaxy, which is known as M31. Now this one M27 the Dumbbell Nebula is actually a planetary nebula. Now a planetary nebula has nothing to do with planets, but is actually a end of life of a star like our own sun. So at the center is a compact core what used to be the core of the star now compacted down to about the size of the Earth and what we call a white dwarf star. So that's the point at the center of this. All around all this material is the outer layers of the star. So most of the mass is down at the center, but the outer layers take up most of the space. And essentially the star has expanded outward and become so large that it is no longer a gravitationally held and pulsations and instabilities within the star can push off those outer layers out into space. And that's what we're seeing here. The colors are actually the colors of two uh, elements. And that is looking at hydrogen and oxygen that are being emitted. So we see the reds and the blues associated with those two. Now we still try to understand planetary nebulae and some of all the structures are things that we really don't know the details. If we look at many planetary nebulae, they're all quite different. So why do they have different structures is something we still strive to be able to understand. And this is the end state of a star much like our own sun. So in 6 billion years, our sun may look something like this to a distant astronomer looking towards our solar system. The inner solar system would be completely gone having been absorbed by the sun. And the outer layers of that star would now expel out and be much larger than the solar system itself. So perhaps in 6 billion years, someone can look back to our own solar solar system and see the end of our sun in something like the image we're seeing today. So that was our picture of the day for July the 12th of 2021. It was titled M27 the Dumbbell Nebula. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be Iapetus 3D. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone. And I will see you in class.